Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be going over how to create an email field in Salesforce. So you're going to want to be in setup. If you're not in setup, then you'll go to this gear icon, click setup, and it'll take you to this page. From here, we're going to go to the object manager. And then we're going to go on to whichever object you want. So we created a new object called new object. We're going to click on it, go to fields and relationships. And I'm going to click new. From here, we're going to choose our data type, which will be email. You can scroll up or down, click next, and it'll take you to the details page. So from here, you're going to want to specify a good name that your field will go by. So I'm going to say it's going to be customer email. The field name will auto-populate. You can add a description if it will be helpful on the back end. Help text if it will be helpful on the front end. Um, and then you have a few other options. We can make it required. Does it have to be unique? Is this an external ID? for another system that's coming into Salesforce. Whichever these are true, you click on, check on them. But I'm gonna scroll down and click next. This page establishes the field level security, which we'll go into into a different video, but essentially decides if it's visible to some users, if some users should have it be read only. I'm gonna click next. This page will add it to the page layout, so you'll be able to see it on your records. But if you want it moved around, then you go to the page layouts section of the object. I'm going to click save. And we now have a new field of customer email. Thank you for joining me for this video. Be sure to give it a like and a subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.